here, so welcome back to our chocolate channel. If you're new here, hi, it's Gracie. We're not new. Hi, so welcome back. Okay, um, so today we're going to be renovating this house. The place is down a lot, but right now I'm just basically, um, showing you, like, what it, um, had for the description. Because I had it up for a little sushi thing. It says, Elmer is a very rich, um, man in Newcrest. One day he said to his parents that he could buy every piece of furniture. His parents replied, so then do it. So, Elmer, um, did, and he enjoyed it. He would never buy two of one thing, but then he finished it, but wanted to keep going, so he collected every door and window for his house, but then he didn't finish, um, in time, and, yes, he died, but now his, um, great-grandson, Tony, inherited the house, and he gotta fix it up, so basically... So now it's time to like show the rooms. It was so hard to like do this. I had to like place every single piece of furniture down first to make sure and like lights and stuff so I didn't miss anything. So I, at first I just had it all on like the lot at like the back, but then I realized that's not enough space. So then I made a basement and start putting filling that thing up, but it didn't, it didn't fit in there either. All of this stuff, so I had to have another floor filled. But yeah. I was gonna, I was gonna try like have everything, wallpaper, flooring, but I didn't think I could fit everything else in there then, with just having one of them. But anyway, plus it took a while. I don't know. Um, like in the first floor, you could tell like I like tried to try a little bit. Um, um, you could see like that toddler room was kind of like decorated nicely. The kitchen was hard since, um, you can't put toasters. No, not toasters. Um microwaves or coffee machines anywhere else it's just there but yeah and then i left a lot of stuff outside too because i didn't know what to do with all and here's where the basement i kind of created like it would be like a little like i don't know if you were like at a somewhere and they just have seats and you're like watching people play on the piano or something over there there's like fridges everywhere i put like oven hoods on over top of them for some reason because there was a ton of oven hoods and not enough ovens but yeah I just started going crazy placing doors anywhere in the basement but yeah no poop and I like used rugs I've never used before because like some rugs are really big this room was like a little um computer room and then this room was like decorative stuff I didn't know those dancing, like, weird block things were in the base game. I've seen them in one of someone's YouTube videos about them. Then there's a bottom floor, which I didn't decorate. I just, like, put stuff there. Okay, this is the second floor up. This is, like, a kid bedroom slash teen bedroom. I don't know. There's just, like, all the children's stuff in here. I tried to jam pack. I wanted all the beds to be next to each other. <laughs> I think I kind of succeeded yeah there's like a gym room there's a little bathroom in there but yeah oh my gosh in that like ski room over there it's like so filled with stuff i thought that would be like just a room that try to cram as much stuff into there oh uh, i think i'll show it soon this is like a little bar room there's a little, a little bar but look at that it's just jam-packed stuff everywhere but yeah then that I didn't put anything in that room yet. This one, just more rooms. <laughs> but yeah, took me quite a bit. Um, yeah, I just got tired of placing everything. But I thought of the idea of like, oh, he died before he could finish it all. But yeah, so basically, yeah, that's the whole build. <laughs> the stuff with the. Mm, what are they called? You can fences right there are so hard to use because it looks so stupid because they're all different heights and I only use one each one once. But yeah. And there's like um window cur curtains on like just plain old walls. But yeah, that's basically the whole build part of it right right now. But now um I think it's the time when we jump into the speed build okay so here we go 
It's leaving like everything everywhere. I left a few things out that I just kind of kept. Because I know that I've used some of them, but I didn't do that for most of the stuff. Just in the beginning. It's like, I think in this room I kept the TV and then some paintings and stuff. But then I end up... I kept a few of them. But I'm like, if I need something, I'll just place it again. Because like... I've, like, watched Hoarders before, which I don't like that show, but, like, they normally just, like, trash everything. I mean, not, well, not most of the time, because people want what they have. But I kept accidentally deleting the doors, but then I just ended up deleting all the doors later. But, yeah. I keep the cupcake machine. I have that on the build, which is kind of cool. Or, oh, poop, I think I accidentally deleted that cupcake machine, though. But I put in a new cupcake machine. And it's like on the second floor. I end up deleting one of the... I don't have any basements or... <laughs> I don't have three floors on the top. And there's just so much room. Um, So I was going to furnish the third floor. But I'm like, I don't know what else to put. There's only this guy who lives here. He doesn't need all this room. Like, the house is still really empty. I didn't like... I had it a lot more open. I didn't keep all like the rooms. But yeah, I thought it looked pretty nice um if you saw what the guy was wearing um you might have like tony he's obsessed with green his hair is like really green his mustache is green and he's wearing some weird kind of green clothes they're like tealish i don't know but the whole house is basically <laughs> green oh the like cabinets i used i okay there's like these one um base cabinets that don't look too bad um they're they come in a ton of different colors those ones but I hate the um top cabinets that come with them like the handles I just don't like that but I put them in the build anyway but it didn't look as bad since I didn't actually use them I used like well I used them but I used the end cabinets together there's like never a really long row just had like two two and maybe two again so I didn't see the so it didn't look too bad. Um, yeah. Um, I didn't make the house smaller and like I didn't get rid of any walls on like the second or first floor. I kept those all the same, but I just like totally got rid of the. Um, I didn't want to think like oh too much of like if you wouldn't normally like. And I didn't. I kind of wanted to put in the foundation, but I was thinking like in real life, like I don't think you can like lift up a whole house. And, but, um, I think I was watching one of Little Simsy's videos once. I watched her a lot. But, um, I think she was talking about, like, you don't just, like, pick up a house and move it. Um, but at my grandma's lake house, the house next door, which is kind of creepy, but, um, it used to be on the other side of the lake. But during the winter one time, they, um, I don't know how they did it. It was, like, a long time ago. Maybe, like, 50 or maybe 40, maybe less than that but I don't know some time a while ago and they like put it on the ice and scooped it all the way up I don't know how they did it because when you're there um like there's like where the house is it's kind of like up here and then it kind of is straight it's going leading down a little bit but then it like goes down a ton when you get to the water well it's good if like you won't really typically get floods but on the other side of the lake it's like really low you could walk up easily but, yeah, they dragged that all the way across. I'm not sure how they lifted it up. Maybe a while ago, the land used to be more flat on that side of the lake. So, they could do it. But that house is kind of creepy. Um, the, like, lights would turn on sometimes. Like, just be on. There's some weird things in the window sometimes. I don't know. That house just kind of freaks me out. Like, there's this one time we thought there would be someone there. My dad told us that there was, but he was just saying that because there wasn't anyone there he like didn't see any cars so uh, there might have been like a squatter in the house but someone else bought it now but yeah they're mad at us since my grandma and grandpa they decided to put up a fence in between the house for like little privacy they used to try um they got a bunch of pine trees there was like six maybe no there was more than six there's like 15 pine trees but they ended up all like kind of dying it didn't do well, but they, they just, just decided to put up a nice fence. It was, it's like a nice fence, not like one of those icky fences, but, but then they got mad, the people next door, and then 
they decided they would make their own little fence out of wood. It doesn't look very nice. And then they put up this like wire like across two trees. Oh, they put up their clothesline and my dad got mad at that because they like hanged up their underwear so we could see it. <laughs> but yeah. So that was, yeah. But yeah, I went up there last weekend. This, yeah. We did, actually it was surprising. We normally always have to do something up there like work on something. Last time we deflated floaties from inside the boathouse. It's cool. That, um, the lake that it's on is the only lake. There's only one other boathouse on that lake because they like just said no because people didn't like how they looked. But yeah, I mean, it's pretty cool. I thinking like if, um, they were somewhere else without a boathouse, I'm like, where would you keep all your stuff? Like down there. Because you could keep a lot of stuff in there. Um, but the people who owned it before, they actually lived inside the boathouse for a while when they were building the actual house. But yeah. Mm, yeah, there's all normally. And we did have to pick up sticks this time. It was good because they learned a lot of sticks everywhere. And then leaves too. Leaves come down all the time. We always have leaf day. The one day we spent like a ton of time, like the day just like taking sticks and then burning them kind of like a little campfire down below which I, I think one of the trees also fell down that year so that no that was the next year but anyway there was a ton of sticks everywhere but there are, kind of always is <laughs> one day um I think it was two times the last time um my grandma asked us when we came up, hey, can you rake up the acorns? I'm like, what? I'm like, so my dad's like, you could try to rake up the acorns, but if it's not working, you don't have to keep doing it. So me and my sister tried to. It really is hard. It's like, they don't come up nicely. But, yeah. But, it's pretty cool in the inside. They updated it a lot. If you, the old people that came there, if they saw it, they probably wouldn't recognize it. There used to be this thing, like, windows, and it kind of went like this. Like, it's kind of a roofy window. But then it got kind of moldy, so then they built onto it. But it kind of, like, made me realize that, oh, you can do, like, some stuff. Like, they literally moved the door. Because, oh, and <laughs> I would sometimes think, like, oh, you, you can't just, like, move a door. That would be too much work. But they did it. But there used to be a window where the new door is. But yeah. <laughs> you hear some weird noise. I'm playing with this um, slap bracelet. It's a ruler too. I actually probably should stop that. It's kind of noisy. But yeah. Um, Right now, still deleting walls. I haven't put anything else on the inside yet. So that's quite a bit. You probably saw me like keep undoing stuff because I accidentally get rid of the actual outside walls. I put all the good new windows in. Cool. Okay. But yeah. I don't... Anything interesting to say. Well, I started crying about my math stuff. I cry a lot during school, I just realized. But... There's this whole foil thing, and I'm not sure how to do it. Because, like, I have my math one up here. And it was like... You have to foil out x over 4 minus 5 squared which would just be if you foiling it x over 4 minus 5 times x divided by 4 minus 5 I don't know how to do that I think there could just be one thing like there like it'd just be like x or the teacher like gave a hint like saying do you use 1 fourth x but I'm still not exactly sure am I supposed to multiply 1 fourth x times 1 fourth x would it just be don't, when, don't you when you multiply fractions it makes it smaller so one eighth x squared that might be but I started freaking out I didn't know how to do that and the problem was because it was the test and we got to like choose one of the three and it was like it's problem six but you could do either a b or c and it was like there's like g of f of x h of f of x they're like the three ones and there's like different problems but i accidentally wrote down 6b when i actually wanted like 6a or 6c so i have 
because I purposely didn't pick this the one I have right now because I didn't know what to do with the with when x was equal to x over 4 minus 5 but then I don't know if I can switch it because I I don't know I could ask try to ask the teacher but I did write down 6b so now I don't know what to do but I didn't do too good with those I got four answers wrong and then like turned out to be what was it I don't know but it, it wasn't good and I grade went down but I probably shouldn't be like complaining because it's not like that bad I mean the four questions I think it was 17.5 out of 22 so a it was like a C but then it made my whole grade like be a B which isn't that bad like sometimes that's all people get is like B's but I'm I don't know but yeah so don't know what to do about that but if I get because I, if I just turn in the one two questions that I the one I didn't get r wrong well maybe I did get it wrong I'm not sure but the teacher wasn't just sure what I wrote down because it's hard to like turn in stuff in pencil and then see it so it was just like is this 21x or 28x and so I just wrote it down I, and then that second one I just messed up because instead of like we're doing domain and ranges and instead of like having say it was like four and then the little line and the greater than or equal to x and then greater than or equal to like 20 like that but we were supposed to like list out the numbers which i thought would be too easy since it already gave us the numbers but i guess that was supposed to be what we we're doing oh um, <laughs> yeah well, that's okay in english reading the audio the odyssey um graphic novel um where did i get to i think i'm on well they call them books instead of chapters but like odysseus um he he just meant it got um he's back on back on ithaca and he's meeting his friend and um telemachus um he just landed back on ithaca too and walked to the place where odysseus is but he's saying hi to the guy that odysseus is saying hi to i think it's something with an eu but i don't remember Oh yeah, I have choir soon, like in 22 minutes, but yeah, so right now I'm working on the bedroom, um, adding some, yeah, if you could see, like, this whole build is really great. I didn't change the floorings yet, I ended up do changing them, I kind of like them in this room, but I ended up, like, turning them all, um, like, have white floors everywhere. With those lamps downstairs, you probably saw that I placed one in, like, the corner in the kitchen. And I just, like, never left it. I'm like, you know what? This is kind of okay. Um, we could just leave that there. Um, yeah, getting some TVs. Oh, if I stop a little bit or, like, it seems like it, I'm, like, just winging around. Because I think my sister came down there for a second. And she, like, walks in. She's like, I cut myself! I'm like, What? And then she's like, yeah, and then she walks into the room, and I can clearly see it's fake, because if you're really bleeding, you're going to be, like, blood's going to be dripping. It's not just going to, it was like, so, this is my knee. She just had, like, a little, like, circle around, and there was nothing else dripping. Like, you're not bleeding. She's like, oh, but I am. <laughs> but, yeah. And then there was this whole thing with the FedEx, a FedEx person they came and they were just waiting and getting a computer sent at her house because someone needed it, but they couldn't get it at their place since last time someone stole something that got delivered to them. So they got it shipped to our house, but um, they just kind of waited there and I guess that you need to like get signed with like a computer, a computer in there, but um, they wouldn't even let me, like if I opened the door, they wouldn't let me sign it because you gotta have you have to be 21 so yeah and <laughs> nobody's gonna be able to get it today i don't think either because my mom left to work like a while ago so and if it comes like in an hour or two nobody's gonna be here besides us so i'm not sure what that's gonna happen but yeah um right now i'm working on like a little 
that's scary up thing. Um, yeah, I think it looked pretty nice. I think I changed, what did I change? Oh, I got rid of the staircase. So it's a little bigger down there. It ends up being that. Um, yeah. Do I? Oh, I think I was trying to keep this all base game. Um, because I had it that in the beginning. But I ended up not having that. I don't remember what I placed that was in it. It was like, there's two packs used. But if you want to download it and if you only have the base game, just do it in way if you want to. I don't know. I don't remember what there was. There's something from like Get Together and Seasons or something. I don't remember placing anything. But maybe I accidentally did. Oh, those bookcases. Are those from Cats and Dogs? I remember there's two. Maybe it wasn't Seasons. Or maybe they are. I don't think those are from the base game. But I, I think I remember looking at them. I don't know. I, but whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Sinks. Oh, yeah. Those. <laughs> Two sinks. I probably could make you put up some more decorations in the house. Oh, and the, the master bedroom. Because I realized there probably should be a bathroom in there. So, that's what I'm going to work on now. Oh, this is when my sister came in and she told me that she was playing. But, it's like a <laughs> naughty bathroom. I don't know what to say. But, there's windows in the whole bathroom. So, if, like, someone came in, you could see them go pee. I don't... Well, yeah? Cool. Did you guys hear that? Sim stuff is half off right now. Go get some sim stuff right now. Um, actually, should probably do that. Be really cool. Ooh, that would be really good. Wait, let me answer. Bunny, what? how long is it half off? Or how? Okay. Ooh. Okay, you guys hear that? Sim stuff is like half off. Go get it now. Go get it now. Ooh, that sounds so much fun. I don't know what packs I'd want to get. I wrote it down. I kind of want vampires or you know, outdoor retreat for like game packs. Because they both come with worlds, which is cool. Um, I really like the build stuff in those two. They're both really cool. Like I like cabiny things. I don't like kind of wooded things. Like Little Simshi, she made like this little outdoor retreat thing. Like in a, It was like a long build thing. But I thought the stuff in there was so cute. And then vampires, they had some really cool, like, um, things, too. I think there's some clothing in there, too, I wanted. Um, oh, poop, I think I wrote a bunch of them down. Don't I have it, like, right next to me? Or did I move that? Oh, then, uh, wait a second. Oh, yeah. Huh. But, yeah. Then there's, like, stuff packs. I know a lot of people really hate, um, my first pet stuff. But there looks like there's some really cool stuff in there. And I thought about getting it. I mean, I have cats and dogs, so. I could. Oh, spooky stuff. I kind of want that one, too. There it looks like they... I really like their, that there's the, um, snow... Like, no, a ghost wall. It looks so cute. And then, like, more holiday stuff. Um, I really only want, um, two more expanded packs. Like, that look interesting to me. Um, city living and, um, discover university. Those two look kind of fun to play with. The beds in Discovery University looks so cute and like the for other furniture that comes with it looks so like good so that's one of the reasons why I want to get that one City Living has apartments and that sounds like fun to um play in I know there was like some more um like stuff packs that I thought or it looked cool but I don't 
exactly remember all of them. Oh, I wrote a bunch of them down. But yeah, so maybe I'll get a few more. Because if they're half off, right, I don't remember what my sister said, but if they're like more deals, then, um, yeah. I wonder if that would work with the thing, like, if there's a thing, if you get, um, like all three of stuff, a game and a expansion pack, you get more money, less money off. I'm not sure if that would work with that. But, yeah. So, basically, I'm wrapping up with the end of the build and, um, yeah, placing, like, outside stuff. But, do you think it's an improvement from the house that it looked before? I mean, I think it does somewhat. Um, oh, next time, um, in my Sims, like, speed build stuff, we're gonna be building this house. So, oh no, where am I? Is this is playing. Oh, I think this is the time with the whole, um, the, what's it called, thing, with the FedEx person, or was it UPS, I don't know, when they came, that's why I was gone a little bit, but, um, yeah, finishing up with some stuff outside, I wasn't <laughs> sure what to do with all the space, I mean, it was kind of big, I didn't really want to, like, I'm not very good at landscaping stuff, like, with big lots, but, yeah, that's how much, wait, I got confused about how much money it was, but I think it ended up being, it was still kind of pricey, um, but, yeah, so that's gonna be the end of the video, <laughs> if you enjoyed it, give a thumbs up, um, hopefully, Tony likes his house now, it's, like, nice, very green, just like him, got, like, they're, like, no, he has blue eyes, but, green hair and green mustache.